Hi everyone, Oma Giona here and today I'm going to be watching Spy Family episode 5. Uh, last episode we saw the family going to the interview and there were a lot of crazy things that happened but they managed to pull through but then during the interview uh, there was this really mean guy who oh, he was just awful and he basically ruined the interview for them. Uh, we had Lloyd, well, Twilight, slowly um, attaching himself to the family. He keeps doing these things that he normally wouldn't do um, because he's a spy and he's used to working alone. But now he has a family that he has to work with. But I feel like he's actually getting attached emotionally to both Yoru and Anya. And we'll see how that goes for him. Episode 5 of Spy Family, let's go. <gasps> the omens. It's crazy when you have like a, a big event happening. Oh, there's a cat. And all like the, the bad things start to happen. And you're like... <laughs> oh no. But some people think it's lucky, you know. Like <laughs> when you step on that. <laughs> Did they not pass? Oh no! <gasps> oh dang! I can't believe they didn't make it. His mission! <laughs> what to do? Oh no. Oh, Anya's probably thinking that she's gonna be abandoned again. No! Oh! Oh, yes! The headmaster. Pull through, man. You can do this. Additional. There's a waiting list. Okay. Oh, that's so nice of him to tell them. For real? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> but the headmaster really likes them. <laughs> She's just gonna kill someone? <laughs> like, just one of them. Kill one! And she's just gonna kill one. Don't say that! She's actually gonna kill you for it! <laughs> Oh man. No, yeah, no. <laughs> She's hearing all of it. <gasps> oh no. Oh, that's so sad though. Like, he got fired for that? She's doing like a dance. <laughs> She's so cute. <laughs> that blitz. <laughs> he got it prepared. That's so cute. Good job. <laughs> Oh no, they're all gonna get drunk and just say the truth. <laughs> I wanna see him drunk. Oh, all the things that would come out of this guy's mouth. <laughs> He's gonna pretend like a spy. He's gonna pretend to be Bonduman, like playing with her. Honey <laughs> human. Oh, dude! She just wants to play! <laughs> Lloydy boy, what? Oh, I love Frankie. <laughs> oh, Frankie's the best. I wonder if Frankie and Twilight actually had 
like a, a backstory between them. Like maybe they knew each other before. I need you to borrow a castle for me. <laughs> it's now for the mission. No, oh, Frank is so cute. <laughs> Are they doing it like right now? Aren't they all drunk? Oh, she is drunk. He's flying it and they're like not wondering. Or at least Yoru is not wondering why he can fly a plane. <laughs> That's so sweet though that they did that for Anya. And I love how they thought it was part of the mission and they're like, just give Twilight whatever he needs. But no, he's just doing it for his daughter. Aww. <laughs> Frankie! Oh? Why? There's no spy stuff. <laughs> She's just holding it against them now. <laughs> Papa. <laughs> They're crazy. They, that's not even it. It's not it's not the mission. Oh man, they're, they're using all their spies for this. It's just for Anya. Oh, she'd love this. <gasps> oh my gosh, they're all spies. <laughs> yeah, because he's the best spy, they just trust whatever he's doing. Like the man. <laughs> Frankie! Frankie is the uh, the worst. I mean like not the worst. Like he's the bad guy. Can be whatever. Ooh, but this could be like almost like a training for them. No, they're all playing against Twilight. Aw, oh, that's so cool. And we're also gonna see how good of a spy Twilight is really is. And it's all gonna be so believable because they are real spies. A really interesting variable about this though is Yoru. Because they don't know that she's an assassin. And also she's drunk. <laughs> He's not gonna be able to answer it. <laughs> <laughs> he has to wear it now. Peanuts! <laughs> Frankie is also taking this seriously. He wants to be saved by her dad. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> oh dang. Oh, he's gonna wear it. Uh, it's so cute. He's wearing it. <laughs> he looks like a robber. <laughs> oh, this is so much fun. Oh, the people. And this is good because everybody gets to have like a good time. Like a break from all their spy work. <laughs> scruffy scruff scruff. Wow, he's really good. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> Yoru is just out. <laughs> She's drunk. <laughs> she doesn't even know what's going on right now. <laughs> Oh, I love how they're taking this seriously, but they're using stuff like balls. And like, it's still safe, but they're taking it seriously. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> it's him. <laughs> oh, they're so cute. Maybe it's just Frankie who really wants to do this. <laughs> Wow, he's walking a tightrope. Yo. Okay, it's too cool. Too cool. Wait, what? They have like fire? 
Looks like Tsukishima. <laughs> ah, hilarious. Was that his belt? <laughs> there has to be like the explosions at the back. <laughs> Frankie. Oh, oh no. She's so good though. Oh no. Oh shoot. <gasps> Cut him! No! Yoru! No! No! Yoru! Yeah, you gotta wonder now, like, what is she really? Oh! <laughs> nope, she down. She down. <laughs> you won. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> what was that even? <laughs> going on they don't even know what's really happening I'm, I'm glad for them actually because I bet the spies are just like Twilight oh like you they have to feel this once in a while Aww. that's actually sweet <laughs> spent so much money on that <sighs> okay that was episode five of spy family that was really fun it was quite absurd uh you know sometimes in anime these weird stuff happen and you don't really have to explain it logically but they happen uh what this episode was just like that like it, it was just crazy how they got the castle and all the spies and um just because anya wanted to play um like do a role play of her favorite show but that was really cute <laughs> because it's nice for everyone like Anya got what she wanted she enjoyed that time um with her family and with so many people too but then the spies they finally got to meet Twilight I bet they haven't met Twilight before this just because he's like the top spy and like, he's the best of the best. He's basically the idol for all the spies. And so for these people to meet him and to do something um, with him, it's like achieving a goal. It It's actually just making a, a little child happy, but they were all working towards a common goal. And that was really nice to see uh, towards the end there, you... Um, you can see them actually rooting for Anya like oh we're so happy congratulations and all that it it wasn't about the mission anymore like they actually feel the emotions like the regular emotions that spies don't usually feel and I love that uh, last part where uh, Twilight he was able to save Anya right and Anya was supposed to say like oh Lloyd man right you saved me but she was like, oh, Papa, you're here. Because at the end of the day, Anya loves him because he's a spy. But she loves him the most because he's her dad. He's the person who took her from the orphanage and is now living with her. And, you know, just doing what she requests and taking care of her. And that's a really big thing for Anya. Uh, I'm excited to see what would happen when they enter the school. Uh, I'm quite bummed that the headmaster is gone, but good for him for standing up for what he believes in and like punching that awful guy in the face. That guy deserved it. But of course, he's like, he's the son of the owner of the school, I believe. So the headmaster actually got fired. That's sad, but I, I know there would be like good people in the school um, to help them out. And I'm really excited to see what Anya's school life is going to be. Uh, what did you think about this episode? Uh, was it too much for you? Was it um, something that you expected from this show? Um, 
what do you think will happen next? Uh, no spoilers, please. If you've read the, if you read the manga, because I, I, I don't read it. But yeah, that's all for me today. Uh, make sure to subscribe for more Spy Family content, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.